Hi guys, been round the charity shops today, nothing at all caught my eye. So then I went in one of my bargain stores, as I call them. This one's called Super Saver Shop. And it's got these little kits. And it, it caught my eye because it's just, well, you've got to smile at the irony of the title. Metal kits. You look at the picture, it's clearly plastic. And it says, includes plastic parts. Quad racer, 68 pieces, do it yourself fun. And it cost £1.35, which is more than I like to spend in a bargain store. A pound is what I like to spend there. But I thought I would buy it just because it just sounds so stupid. A metal kit made from plastic. So we'll open it up and see what's inside. Okay, yes there are some metal parts and there's some plastic parts. I expect if we counted them up we could decide whether it's a metal kit or a plastic kit. Got the instructions. Looks fairly straightforward. We've got a screwdriver and a spanner and a bonus we've got a bit of polystyrene packaging that we could probably make something out of later so I won't throw that away obviously you could use the cardboard box as well I might think about that so how many bits have we got well it says 68 pieces so no doubt they count the nuts, bolts and screws as pieces. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 plastic pieces. And they say 68 altogether, so yes, the majority of it is metal, if we go by numbers. <laughs> ah, dear. Got the glasses on, so let's see. Don't say which length screw to use. Choose a shorter one. There we are, fully assembled, went together all right, followed the instructions. Not quite sure what it's supposed to be. It says a quad racer, but I don't think these bits do anything, any, be any benefit. And I don't think this bit on the back does anything, but I suppose it adds to the looks. 
bit disappointed that the axles are a fairly tight fit in these plastic frames because it would have been nice if it had been a push along toy when you'd finished with it but they don't spin so that's the opposite problem to the little kit I made the other day where they could have put the axles in but they didn't in this kit they've put the axles in but they're no good they're a tight fit anyway all went together we got screwdriver left got a spanner left we've actually got two nuts and two bolts and three of those little bits of plastic left as well so I'll save them plus we got a little bit of styrofoam that I could probably use for something and obviously a cardboard box so metal kits includes plastic parts quad racer Followed the instructions and we've got a little kit. Job done. Just to make the point about the axles, I've rearranged the pieces so the axles are now in the metal frames and they're nice free running axles now. So for the sake of a little bit of extra design work, they could have had a nice little push on car. And those axles would have been alright for that other kit that I made the other day that just screwed the wheels in place instead of putting them on axles. Job done.